Yeah, I was just having a conversation while we hung out at the cabin. That's a lovely night, and uh, one of the things we discussed was, you know, doing side jobs, the risk of doing side jobs. When you do side jobs, a lot of times you're not licensed or insured or whatnot. You take up a, a, a risk. And that risk is usually, you know, if a person knows, you know, usually it's like half down, half would complete, you know, how you do most jobs. And when you do that, you take a risk that, you know, that person pays you half, you do the job, and when you're done, it comes to your payment. They say, well, you're not licensed or I'm not obligated. We didn't sign a contract. We're not obligated to pay you. And they can walk away, you know. And uh, you, there's nothing legally, nothing you really can do. I mean, there's nothing, you know. There's nothing you can do. You could you, you try to take stuff back, well, then you're stealing. You could get rough with them, well, then, you know, that's a whole other can of worms, you know. So, I kind of in that situation with a lot of different clients that basically they're tough on money, they need something done. I felt bad for them, and I needed money. And I did stuff for them, and a couple of them got away with a lot of work done for just about nothing. And a couple of them, I stopped doing the work halfway through when I realized that the money wasn't coming in and said, well, when you catch up with the money, I'll start doing work again, you know, because, you know, I already had seven people do it to me. I'm not going to have it happen again. If I can catch it, I nip to the butt. And now they're acting like they got Alzheimer's, like they've already paid me for what's done, and now they want to pay me, come back, do the rest, I'll pay for the rest. And it's like, no, I don't think so. You're just going to stick with half your stuff done. Tough cookies. That's the way I got to be. I can't keep giving away my skills and my labor for free. So uh, if this happened to you, let me know. Send, you know, your reply. <laughs> comments, I'm sorry, not reply. Tell me what you think. We're about ready to head back home, back to Flint. Say bye to a nice campfire and the lovely atmosphere that is Gladwin, Michigan. Lock up the cabin. So, take care guys. Bye.